one of my earliest memories um, in my formal education was in primary school and I was trying to think for this interview what, what makes a great teacher and it's actually this one woman, she's, she must have been really young, she was a student teacher and I don't even remember what she did with us in the classroom but what she did with us one day was um, she asked us all to talk about our interests and us and what floated our boat, what our favourite animal was and um, what we did outside of school and we must have been about six or seven and as she was leaving on her last day she actually presented each one of us in our class with this little female animal so made out of like plasticine you know the, the stuff you can bake like uh, coloured clay and for example mine was this, was this cat that had running shoes on because that's what I was into at the time not anymore <laughs> cats and running um, but the it blew my mind as such a small gesture, but actually she obviously went to a lot of trouble to kind of personalise the learning for us. And that wasn't, personalised learning was not something that I knew about or even thought about, but it really stuck with me. And thinking about other kind of exemplary moments for me and made me love learning and love certain teachers was always that, um, that moment where they looked at you as an individual and they took the time to kind of get to know you and I think when I visit schools and when we participate at schools and, and see the best teachers they so know their students and they so care about it and that passion is is all over it and yeah so I, I'm that was that was very special. <laughs>